hypocrite. <laughs> this is a really bad hand. Hey guys, welcome back to Daily Duels. So today is Wednesday, Using means we're using Marmels, and we're also joined by Slate. Hey, what's up? He's a hypocrite. So, no, I, uh, I made one video hyping up a card, or two cards, and now he thinks that it's not okay that I said he hypes up cards. Yeah, because you're talking all that good shit. Uh, <laughs> because I know you look good, you cards are either trash or fucking broke with you. Like, no, they're not. Just because the cards that I look at are either trash or really good. All right. I guess. But now uh, I'm not, I'm, I'm just going to just start, you know, finishing up other cards and stuff that I need to look at. So, ooh, all right. Why? Um, is he going to blind? Yep. He's gonna... back row? Yep. Why? <laughs> because was he, he can. Was, he was he... playing some sort of OTK. No, he's it? playing battling boxers. He just sent a boxer. Wow. Oh, it's, I didn't see it. Um. No. <laughs> you want to make yourself? Oh, that's Chalice. I thought that yeah. was Lance. Nah. Oh, people are playing Chalice now. You know. Yeah. They Chalice. must have seen our video. Chalice is actually a pretty good card. Yeah, I know, but I'm just saying that people are main decking it now, and like decks <laughs> that aren't that aren't Cleepert, so that's pretty cool. Ha. Ah. We, we got to keep we got to keep the gear frame because I could chain Chalice. That was pretty good. Yeah, that was pretty good. Nice. God damn All right. It. I got like no senders. Fuck. I do not. I do not know boxers. You do I not know. Like, you do not know what? I don't know boxers. I don't know how they play. Oh, I don't know. they just summon. I mean, they just summon lead blow. Like that's that's literally all they do. I know that. Blow. Yeah, I know that his effect is that when he would be destroyed, you catch, and then he gains eight hundred attack. I just don't know what the other monsters like do individually. Like I know that they like to use um. Uh, Mass Chameleon, because that guy there has zero defense. Mm -hmm. So, yep. Trank card is oh my god, Armadies is so good. Ah, uh, he is. Um, well, it's a girl, but <laughs> but uh, Armadies in Gangzing, you can get her up to twenty eight hundred attack. Like, do you realize how good that is? Yep. That's that's crazy. Like Yang, ah, I love Yangzing. I haven't I haven't played them yet. I haven't I haven't played with them yet. But like in theory, Yangzing seems like such a good deck to me. Yeah. I just played it. <laughs> really? Yeah, I just recorded a vitamin Y, so I was using Cosmic Q Bell. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. I have to I'll be like, oh, I got that level 4, so <laughs> I'm going to hop off that level 4 now. I mean, that guy, that Belling Boxer guy's pretty much out of the duel, because god damn. <laughs> what the... Well, upstart. He pretty much used up his start... entire hand. What? Do you think Upstart is a mandatory card? What do you mean, a mandatory card? A staple at three in every uh, deck? No. It seems like that's the way... I mean, for the first time ever, I read the, you know, the whole 37-card deck article that Patrick Hoban read, you know, or wrote it, I meant. Um, he wrote it like two years ago, right? And I just read it. I don't know. Because I don't play Upstart, really. I don't um, play Upstart. It, except in alternate win condition decks, because then not playing upstart you know um but i don't know um I, i've been like i've been warming up to it because i realized that like my theory at first was that if you draw it like you never want to draw upstart right you're playing 37 cards to reduce the amount of cards in your deck right and then if you draw upstart it's just like drawing any other card in your deck except you have to give your opponent a thousand life points so why would you do that you know what i mean deck then yeah the, yeah that, that's that's the point um I don't know. It's it's okay. Uh, I mean, the the popularity of Upstart's definitely been going down because of Soul Charge, because everybody's afraid of giving their opponent thousand life points. That's one more monster they can. God damn, that's one yeah. more monster they can summon it's with. Uh, wow. Yeah, with Soul Charge. So that popularity's been going down. But if you know Soul Charge ever gets hit, it'll probably shoot back up. Uh, I don't really it's... play Upstart because of what decks I play. Like I don't play Upstarts in my can stuff. I feel like I'd rather have the consistency. And not give my opponent life points, and an upstart can just be another back row, in my opinion. That's kind yeah, of how I feel bad. Unless I'm was, running that... something so fast and aggressive that it requires. It really depends on the deck. Like if it's a sl thought, if it's yes. if it's slower decks, then no, don't yes. run upstart. No, not Constellers, not Evil Storm, no upstart. But if you're running like a fast aggressive deck, like you know some kind of Dragon Ruler variant, then give them the life points. So you're probably gonna go so fast, you're probably gonna snatch those life points right back. So you don't care. Yeah, like 
Yeah, some like um like Sylvans need like some like it needs their combo pieces. Like I don't know, maybe even maybe even Mermail so you can get that extra Atlantean in this card. Yeah, like I I I wouldn't mind seeing. I don't I wouldn't be surprised if Mermail's run upstart. All right, so what's going on with this guy? He can't. I don't know. I don't know. He plays upstart and then. I say no response. Why is it waiting though? Like, I have no idea. Am I supposed to be responding? You must have like something to chain in his hand. All right, we'll keep that in mind. Uh, keep in mind that um, his fucking bar is almost full and he hasn't done shit the entire turn. So that play upstart. Eight, sec- his turn you is almost activate, over. You can activate five ancient leaps right now. Wait, no, nine. Wait, how many how many life points does ancient leap pay? Hey? Thousand or two thousand? Two thousand. All right, so we can activate five ancient leaps. That's amazing. I thought they did it so if he doesn't do anything, they pass turn. I didn't know that they automatically lose. I thought they changed that on Depro. Oh, well. Eh, oh, well. We'll get another door. All right. So, yeah. Upstart. I don't think Upstart's the broken one. Upstart's kind of like, you give me a thousand life points to one for one. You you play Upstart, you draw. That That's fine. I don't mind that. You know? you, you The whole 37 card theory is nice. You know, it helps decks that don't have uh, fill or to go ahead and, you know, make themselves a little bit more consistent by running Upstart, but Upstart's not the broken one. The broken one is Reckless. Reckless, Reckless should be at one. Yeah, Reckless, Reckless should be at one. Because even, oh, Mirror Match, I guess. <laughs> Pseudo Mirror Match. Because even with what he get rid of, he got rid of Ambient Tree, okay, but there's no face-up card to pop. He probably didn't have anything else. I guess. What'd he add? I didn't see. <laughs> he added, uh, he added the one that pops face out. Oh. Okay. I don't know the Marksman. Marksman. <laughs> okay. No, but like, if you open up multiple Reckless, you're just so ahead of your opponent for like no downside. Like, wow. Okay. With actual so, back row, did you just get a whole bunch of bits for your MST? One of them during the end phase. Okay. Um. <laughs> I don't care. Just throw up sure. one. Throw that one. Okay. okay. Yeah, it's in a bit fair. Don't I did. Yeah, in a bit fair is fine. Okay. Um. Okay, so if you open up with, with Triple Reckless, you win the game. Like, there, there's no chance that you're not going to win. Um, no, if you, open like up you just double drew reckless, fucking a new hand, pretty much. Like, that's ridiculous. Yeah, if you open up with Double Reckless, you're plus one for four... You're plus one or more for four turns, which is crazy. Um, and if you open just one Reckless, even, which is why we were talking about... Even Limited, it's still a pretty powerful card. If you open up with one Reckless, like, you can um, still get uh, one, two turns ahead of your opponent for... But one like two turns, right? Mm-hmm. So yeah. it's pretty good. At that point, I'd pretty much say it's kind of like a pseudo staple. And like all the chains. Then you links. can reckless. In, then you can rec. <laughs> then you can reckless into like other recklesses, right? Oh my god! Come on. <laughs> really? I want a duel. Wow! I know <laughs> I want a duel. Like really? Just because I have the fucking answer for your fucking moon rally? You want to be a pussy like that? Okay, fine. We're trying to have a good conversation here and a good duel. And these guys want to keep on quitting all the damn time. Be right back. I don't really want to talk about it. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> no, no, no. I just, I don't know. Do you want to talk about it on the recording? Sure. <laughs> uh. Go ahead and do your gadget play. I opened up double gear playing. Gadgets double lance, so I figure I can protect the protect the gadget. Uh, no, it only chain lance. All right, cool. Wait, you opened up a gear frame and you didn't summon gear frame and search for like a fortress? That's surprising. Nah, I can just do that the next turn. Like I said, I can protect the gadget this turn. So, hopefully, depends on what we're going up again. But, uh, that's not noble knights, different. noble knights, noble knights, calling it noble knights, noble knights, noble knights. Heroes, noble knights. heroes. No. Shit. Woo! <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. You can actually. Yeah. Can, can, can you? Uh, attacks, I'm actually gonna lance. Uh, oh, lance wow. him, lance him, lance him. Block him from the mass change. Make him unaffected. He'll be hey. unaffected. Are you sure? Yeah, I mean, uh, he's gonna make Ab Zero and wipe your. At- I mean, what's he gonna make? He's gonna make acid and wipe your back row anyway, so you might as well Wait, make his he, uh, mass change for that. Yeah, he's gonna, gonna he's gonna be unaffected. MST, what? And MST doesn't negate! <laughs> MST negate! Yes. MST negate! <laughs> MST negate! Yes! No, I don't want to change another card. MST negate! Oh my god. Yes! <laughs> yes! 
Mmm, the salt. <laughs> that was great. Oh my gosh, that was amazing. Ah, the salt of the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see what you did there. That's yeah. cute. <laughs> Woo! Wow, I opened up stupid. Bro, he's, he's only got. We got a lance to protect you from that single back row. It's probably just like. I don't even know. Another yeah. mask. One. A two. Oh, we. Pop it. Nice. <laughs> a three. <laughs> Get hella <laughs> soon. <laughs> That's funny. Um. Pow. Pow. What? <laughs> I don't want to know. Full charge. Woo! You know what I'm gonna go for main phase two. Black Rose. <laughs> yeah, totally. <laughs> That's what I was just thinking that. I swear I was just thinking that. No. Um I mean, yeah, uh, you should probably go for Leo, but uh, uh yes, I'm going for Leo. <laughs> Yeah, I guess, yeah. I I'm just thinking that, you know, if there's a level 7, that's that's good, but, uh... No, no. The only well, because... That... No, I'm gonna keep your gadget. I'm, I'm, I'm just thinking Leo. about what heroes would do, like, to get rid of Leo, like... So... Uh, Absolute Zero. What is Absolute Zero? I meant Acid before. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, The other Water one actually isn't that bad. Um, But, yeah, Acid's obviously way better. But, uh, what's his name? Um... The other water one, it's just he can't be disturbed by card effects. I think that's okay. Uh, I forgot his name too. Free gun against at. Uh. Uh. How strong is he? Isn't but isn't construct uh, naturally stronger than him? I got no what? response for that. Construct stronger than who? Than uh the hero guy. No Which one. The, the other guy, is. the one that can't be destroyed by a card effects. How is he good against, uh, against, uh, Shadals? I said he was good against, I said he was good against Hat. Oh. Because, oh. um, Hat destroys using Morale Talk, which is a card effect, um... Fire Hand. Fire Hand and Bottomless, and, and he can't be destroyed by any of them. What's his freaking name? This Trap Trap tra Hole Nightmare? What is his name? Ah, uh, it's like it's, right it's, on the tip of my tongue. I can't think of him. Um, I'm look, it's okay. I'm looking it up. Look it up. Um, Mass Hero. Mm-hmm. Uh, Vapor. I knew it started with a V. I was thinking like Volan or something. Oh, totally. Nice. Wait, when did you activate that? When he changed oh, it, he used the effect. Yeah, I was about to say. Alright. Nice. I mean, he's still gonna kill the guy, I can't save it. So what's your hand right now? Double gear frame, yellow gadget, uh, that's it. Double gear frame. And yellow gadget, I guess it should have, so I don't know. I mean, I, no, I, I, I'm glad I summoned a gadget, because I can just normal summon gear frame and pitch the... Gadget and summon uh, fortress. Or actually, yeah, yeah, that's probably what I do. Normal summon. Ah, oh, fuck. No, that's that's fine. I'll play it on the end phase. I was, I was hoping do we have that... another lance set? No, we have oh. Abyss Fear and MST. We didn't need to get rid of that now, but it's okay. Well, don't you want to summon and search with your uh, gear frame at least? What'd you draw? Oh wow, I drew a Kage. Nice. Okay. Can you uh, make a so one on can... one? Make a one on one. Or cast. I... Uh, um, do I even have Castell in here? Uh, Either or, I don't care. Okay, but just... yeah, he's, he's, he's actually. It's funny though, because I want to keep the TCG, but I'm playing Mega Form. <laughs> uh, all right. Normal summon gear frame. Back. Yes. Chain Kage to Kage. Yeah, make one on one just so he doesn't get his effect. Because we do not want Delta. We don't want him plusing anymore. It, it can miss timing, right? You can special summon one teller on a monster screen deck. It's kind of sent from the field. Oh, the field to the graveyard. Mm -hmm. Okay, so doesn't even matter. Uh, let's grab a fortress. So what was the other guy using? I can't remember. Heroes. Heroes. He was using heroes. <sighs> um. You can summon. You can summon fortress if you want to. It's up to you. Yeah, I'm. I'm going to. I'm just thinking. The only thing I'm worried about right now is if this. I just hit the wrong freaking card. I, I misclicked. I misclicked. 
I misclicked. Shit. Oh my god. I misclicked. No. <laughs> wow. All right. Ah. <laughs> uh. Uh, it's okay. We can just attack over it with Leo, right? So yeah, then he'll get his effect. I didn't right, want him to get um, his effect. Hmm. You had one job. <laughs> <laughs> uh, huh. All right. Whatever. So I'm still attacking over it. Yeah. All right. And if he honest, I'm gonna punch you in the mouth. Okay. Sorry, God, I'll punch you in the mouth so hard. Actually, should I should not attack main phase two and then just send whatever he summons to the graveyard? It depends on what he summons. He's gonna get his effect as soon as it's summoned. I know, but okay, so he's gonna uh, summon Altair, then Altair summon Deneb. No, summon him back. Okay. Uh, so. What's stopping me from just attacking over both of them? <laughs> Nothing. But right? then he'll get his effect yeah. again. Oh, so... Uh... Let's... Huh. I guess I'll just... So I don't know what to win. do. <laughs> you could've went into a lot of... You could've went into Dweller. You could've went into... I, it was a misclick. I meant to go into 101. Uh, no, but still, I misclick into Black Ship. <laughs> I'll see if he does. Yeah, it was bad. Summon the Neb and search. All right. I'll care. Doesn't matter so, if you like tell you might as well send. At least we get. Yeah, some yeah, because I'll get the thousand damage. <sighs> And I'll send this one because he can't Altair for Altair. Um, no, that was the. I think I made the best out of that. Shut up. <laughs> I'm mad at you. Yeah. Uh, I was like struggling to pick too because I don't know. I was trying to see if there's anything better than 101. So. Oh my god. What? Okay. That's fine. I mean, I know Blaze Man is a pretty good card. But... Shining? That's fine. Um, Form change. change. So he's gonna bring out what? Koga? I'd bring out Koga. I think it just has to be with the same level, so he can bring out anybody. Yeah, Koga. Yeah, that's Koga. What I okay. No, I know, but Koga's the one that I'd bring out. Holy he has shit! <laughs> he can attack over Leo, that's why. <laughs> Holy sh balls! And he, well, and he gets to make me zero. Are you oh, kidding me? Yeah. Damn. Wait, why did he make? Why would he? I don't know. Oh, because he has no hand. Okay, that makes sense. Maybe he just wants to get rid of the force until he has no hand. Damn. I don't, I, yeah, that's crazy. Oh, and he can't target Leo. So. The level 10 or the level 7? Is that doesn't, permanent? That's not permanent. No, it's it? till the end of the turn. Alright. Doesn't matter. <sighs> so we get this deck in February. Okay. The Mass Zero structure deck. Damn, that's we get a lot in of February. damage. Okay. You're both bad. <laughs> but it really Ooh. doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. Yeah, I, I, I would take out Leo. I would take out Leo. There you go. I would take out Leo also. I don't even know why he reduced his attack. Like, he just wasted a Neos. Yeah, that was, that was pointless. He just wasted a Neos. I want that. What, you're gonna big eye it? Yep. Nice. He'll ha he'll only have 25 attack though, but. Big eye's so good, man. Yep. I haven't had a big eye used on me in a long time, so I'm kind of starting to warm up to him. At, at, for a long time, I thought big big eye should be hit, but. Instead of hitting big guy himself, we just hit the decks that can put out a whole bunch of big guy, which in the end we did. So now the decks who used to be able to jump throw out a whole bunch of big guy can't do it as much. So no, it's not like Mermels are big pretty guy. good at throwing out a whole bunch of big guy. I mean, uh, I mean, I've been saying hit Mermels for how long? They're not gonna hit these motherfuckers. I don't know why. Just kill these motherfuckers. I'm tired of this deck. I mean, I need to. Mm. All right.
better to be in attack mode. Because if you can just summon something and run my ass over in defense. Ooh, that is a shit ton of damage. Now he, yeah, I was about to say he comes back out. Is that game? You tell me. I think that, no, it's not game because Big Eye can't attack. 5,000. Yeah. What did you just do? <laughs> what? You like, I don't know. Oh, that. That? Yeah, that. Thanking? <laughs> Oh my god, dude! I am going to fucking eat my hat if he if he runs that uh one uh thunder horse thing <laughs> and fucking wipes my ass. Like, goddamn, he's gonna wipe my ass! <laughs> oh, th th oh, oh my god! Oh my god! What is that? I mean, I know you can only use the effect once per turn, but I, doesn't matter. I can't. Um, I send from the grave. Why did you send it to the graveyard? I don't know. I guess since they so can't, they can't be, be special summoned, I guess it goes to the graveyard? What the fuck? I've never heard that ruling in my I've life. I've never heard that ruling in my life. Yep, he's gonna go for... Whoa, okay. Oh, this, this guy's bad, yeah. God yeah. damn! He's a, he's OCG, luckily, but he's, he's really strong. We can't summon. I can't summon. Nope. Whoop, we lose. Did not no, see that it. coming. Did not see that coming, not even remotely. Alright, um, I'm gonna pass. Yeah, just pass. I was oh. I was gonna set, but I think it would be better if I just passed. <sighs> Holy shit. Alright, so he's unaffected by other card effects right now. Mm-hmm. But at the end of the turn... No, it's the end of your opponent's be... turn. Nah. -uh. Yeah? So wait, he has four materials or three? Yeah, four. Oh my... Are you serious? I can't summon either. Like, holy shit, no one the and their mother saw that coming. What the hell? This is why, this is why Satellar Knights are better in the, uh, OCD than they'll ever be in the TCG. I don't, I don't think Satellar Knights are gonna be that strong. They're not. Yeah, I was, I was gonna tell you that before. But, uh... I just wanted to mix that. I'm making the deck for fun. I just need a I fun deck that's to, not the I was talking to this other YouTuber, um, DZ. Do you know who that is, Daniel? No. Alright, so DZ, I was talking to him about side deck. Right? And he thinks that Satellar Knights are going to end up being the best deck. He told me to side deck, um, <clears throat> and he said he was pre he's, pre he's pretty good at Yu-Gi-Oh! So, like, I'm not, like, you know, I'm not by any means, like, like saying this is wrong. But he said that uh, people should side uh, Stygian Dirge. You know that card? The one that handles light monsters? Stygian Dirge. It, uh, it reduces the levels of all the monsters your opponent controls by one. Oh. So, um... What it would do against Satellar uh, Knights is basically shut down their entire deck because they only play rank fours. No. no. So, if they ever do get, oh my god, we didn't lose, did we? I think we lost. I think we lost. Like that guy. Forty-four and thirteen. Now we or three thousand. We didn't lose. We didn't lose yet. Yeah. But you still can't normal summon or or special summon. No, I can. He just will. He's just. No, he still has three. So yeah, he's unaffected by other card effects. So I just have to attack oh, yeah, oh, yeah. He's just Let me see if I can attack over him. If you can attack uh, over him and get that extra... If we can get that 700, I would be so happy, but I'm I'm not saying it. Oh, oh, no, he's unaffected by the card effect. Shoot, I was going to say I could rag and zero. I could, I could, you know, I can't do any of these effects. I, have to, I, I legit have to attack over him. Um, you know, during your end phase, he, during your I end can phase, cowboy, yes. I can cowboy for game. Let's oh, go. cowboy for game, then. Nice. Cowboy for motherfucking game. Nice. I was to say, during his, during your end phase, he would detach an Xe material, which means that during their turn, you could have ragged and zeroed. Yeah. This but is fuck it. Cow, fucking cowboy. I'm playing the damn this music. Is what he, this fuck is what this he gets. He's going to be mad, too. He thinks he won the game. I know. He's going to be mad, too. Where's this cowboy? There's the cowboy. Play that. Where? I'm playing I'm playing the music. I'm editing it in. I'm playing that music. Thank you, cowboy. Thank you. I love you. Never leave my extra deck. You win <laughs> games. GG. SRDs. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hold yeah. the dick. Hold Cowboy's dick. <laughs> okay. Three, two, that was good. good. That was good. Yeah, that was nice. It's a good one to end on. It's already 25 minutes. Yeah, I know. That's what I said. It's a good one to end on. Yeah, yeah. Alright, I thought you said let's get another one in. I'm like, no, 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 no. It's already 25 minutes.
Alright, so that was good. That was good. It was a good conversation. We didn't argue. We tagged really well. It was awesome. Yeah. Even with that whole that that whole uh, reckless stuff, I did not know it was gonna send to the graveyard like that. I did not see that coming. I didn't even know that was a rule. Neither did I. Uh, I've on um, I've been on dueling network and people have activated that. I just didn't summon anything. So I don't know if maybe I'm wrong. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. I got I think maybe because the field was full that maybe it did it? Or I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. I guess. Uh it doesn't say anywhere on the I read the card, it doesn't say anywhere on the card or send them to the graveyard. It doesn't say that, so. Oh. Sure. Uh, okay, whatever. I'll send all my Lynn. That was kind of dumb, but if I knew it was going to do that, I wouldn't have selected Lynn. I just selected <laughs> Lynn for just Chols, because that's the only target that I could select that I'd be able to summon, but then it, I thought it was just going to fizzle my summon, and no one was going to do that. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call that uh, an episode. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Thank you, Slate, for joining me. Yep. So uh, be sure to go ahead and subscribe and. And look, look, watch Slate's videos. Well, they're good. Yeah, yeah. I've, been, I've been making more. Uh, I've been making discussions. Uh, I'm going to have probably a duel posted in the next couple days. So go yeah. ahead and uh, check that out. Yep, so click that link in the description. Go over to his channel. Dislike all his videos. And uh, <laughs> 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 No, don't do that. And uh, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for all the support. And I will see you guys tomorrow using uh, Pendulum, Chaos, Mythic, whatever dragons. And also tagging with Tiago. Thanks for watching.